before it's too late. Amazonia, Brazil. Billions of acres of primary forest. It's estimated 20 million species of plants and animals live there. The identity of many of these species is still unknown to humanity. And even before they become known and named, they are critically endangered, heading for extinction. The Amazon is a perfectly closed environment. An ecosystem where the nutrients that sustain life are continually being recycled through the plants and animals that live there. The constant climate allows organisms to survive in very special niches, creating uniquely independent ecosystems. This means that many species only occur and survive in a single location. These species rely on other species for their existence, with others equally reliant upon them. And if one is lost, its effect on the ecosystem could be catastrophic for the remaining species. And too many are disappearing too fast. Every minute, 240 hectares of ancient old growth trees, the world's air conditioning, crash to the ground. And these are the victims, or at least some of them the pied bare-faced tamarind, the woolly monkey, the red-backed squirrel monkey, the spider monkey, the Midas tamarind, the red ukari, and many, many as a group of species, these mini monkeys of Brazil are some of the most endangered on the face of the planet. It's, it's very bad. We are in a very bad situation now in Brazil. To tell an Amazonian man to not cut a tree is just t telling an uh, Eskimo not to touch the snow. The forest for the Brazilian people is nothing. The government agency responsible for endangered species and for 
parks and reserves right now uh, is basically being cut in half. The staff is being fired. The babies, the babies are really beautiful and their eyes and sometimes you can see that they are screaming for help and yeah.